And Jordan Cannon gets the rebound on that end, and the Knights will have it again. Weber gets the pass after being double teamed. Cliff Brown slams it down. Stovall fires it over to Sabus. The press in this game from Grinnell has been outstanding so far. Larson trapped in the backcourt. And here's Sabus driving down. Josh Galing fakes him out from Henry Ward. That's off the rim, no good. Jaron Sabus fires it down to Galing once again, and he gets points number three and four off of that bucket. Wasty gets a fancy little rebound, tips it over to himself, and the Knights have it. What a pass by Cliff Brown. A lot of deep passes in this game. Here's Wasty down low, and he puts it up, and that's no good. He gets his own rebound, and it's in, and one. With the way this team plays, they're only four possessions out of this game. Yeah, a lot of energy is key to a good game. And Grinnell is certainly showing that right now. Gets a basket. Sabus finds Wasty down low. Wasty pump fakes. Galing gets another bucket for him. Here's Kalen finding Jordan Cannon. Behind the back pass to Josh Galing. And that'll do it. Knights come up with a big victory scoring their m the most points that they've scored in a game since 2004. First, nice time win. That, first time that both teams went over 100 since that same game, November 27, 2004, against Grinnell. Some of the highest scoring games in Warburg's history have always come against Grinnell, and this was just another example why. 126 to 100 final score.